Hey everyone, I'm out here in the garage with the Acura RL once again. And what I thought I'd do today is a really simple procedure on this car, and that's replacing the wiper blades. So stay tuned. So I got a question in the comments section about changing the wiper blades on the Acura RL. So I thought I'd walk through that procedure on this car. And I usually change the wiper blades on my car usually about every six months because I live in the Pacific Northwest where it rains a lot here. We get uh, quite a few days of rain every year. So it's very much important in this area that we change the wiper blades more frequently. Whereas in other parts of the country, you may not have to do that. So usually if you notice any streaking on the windshield or if you notice that the wipers are kind of shuddering across the windshield, then it's probably a good time to actually replace the wiper blades. So let's jump into replacing the wiper blades on the RL. So one of the issues with changing the wiper blades on the Acura RL is that the wiper arms are tucked underneath the hood here and up against the cowl. You can see right here if we pull up on the wiper arms, we have no clearance to be able to get the wiper blades off. So let's talk about how we move these wiper arms into position to be able to get the wiper blades off. So the question that was posed was whether you can actually pull on the wiper arms and pull them up into position on the windshield so that they're more accessible. And I personally would not do that, and I'm going to show you exactly how I do it. All right, so I'm in the cozy confines of the Acura RL, and what I'm going to do is get the wiper blades up into position straight up so that I can replace them. So normally how I do that, I put the key in the ignition, and then I'm just going to turn it to the interval setting. So I'm going to wait for the wipers to come back up. About right there, pull the key out. And now our wiper blades are in the position where we can actually take them off the wiper arms. So the wiper blade on the driver's side is 22 inches and the wiper blade on the passenger side is 19 inches. And the procedure is the same for both wiper blades. There's no difference in procedure. All right, so now that I have both wipers up into position, I've got them far enough over that I can actually change them both on this side of the car. I don't have to walk all the way around. There's a couple different options here. If you have you know, a wiper blade that has the ability to just change this part, the refill, then for example, this one has a tab right there. You just press down on this tab. You can take this off and replace it. Otherwise, there is another tab underneath here right there. You just press down on that and you slide this off. Then put your new one on. Just reverse the process. It should snap right on. And there you go. Alright, so there you have it. There's a procedure for replacing the wiper blades on the 1999 Acura RL. Very, very simple. And of course, when you do this the first time, it looks a little challenging, like you're not sure how to approach it. And then thereafter, it's usually pretty easy. So hopefully this information was helpful. And thanks for watching.